Steele last night. Yes, as I came home, I saw him going to his apartment with a girl. That girl was murdered between 1 and 2 o'clock this morning. seen her before. When a girl was killed, and because of that, I found what I was looking for. First, you have to have enough imagination to visualize the crime. You're driving up the canyon. You put your right arm around her neck. You get to a lonely place in the road, and you begin to squeeze. You're an ex-GI. You know judo. You know how to kill a person. Go ahead, go ahead, brother. Squeeze harder. <laughs> No, Dix didn't do it. You saw him after the girl left. But Lochner has a different idea. He believes Dix could have done it. I left his office feeling as though he were trying to warn me. I came here because I wanted to say these things out loud and be laughed at. But you're not laughing. Let me in. So are you taking to Las Vegas? And no, no, I know. Are you I packing to go on a honeymoon? Yes, of course. Are you packing to run away from me like you ran away from Mr. Baker? 